So with this latest release of Media Central Cloud UX, one of the most asked about features is the ability to do translation. So I've got this clip here. You can see I've already got uh, transcription, but if I click on translation, you can see I have the options um, to translate some uh, new versions of this as well. Now I'm just gonna move this out to show you that I've already got like English, for example, and Japanese, but I, if I hit this kind of plus button, I can create a new translation. I can select that. You can see that I have a transcript. I can have a target language. So I'm just gonna go down there and I'm gonna say Danish, hit that translate button. And what that will do, it will translate that content and that's available then to you in the system. So this is one of those most uh, kind of asked about features and we finally got it in here um, as well. One of the other things about Media Central uh, 25.10, is gonna incorporate the new Avid production management and that brings in lots of uh, additional tools as well. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna uh, go up to here to the uh, inspector, drag that down. So I've got my inspector in a video and I'm just gonna select a clip and double click that clip. And you'll see now I get information about this clip. I get the properties. So this is my technical metadata. Uh, I can see where the clips are being used, right? So this is being used in these various edits. I can look at asset location as well. Very useful for people who need to know in you know, a media manager know about their um, assets as well. And then with this now, we also give you the ability to do what you know you needed to have other applications to do in the past. You can do all of that inside of Media Central as well. So in this example, if I want to kind of look at some information about the clip or perhaps get rid of the clip, I can right click it. And then what I can do is I can choose delete and you'll see now I've got this new dialogue here as well. And you can see here, I can see my production management database, I can see his projects, I can see where it at. And then, you know, if I want to just get rid of the metadata, I can select that. If I want to get rid of the media, I can go through and do that as well. I'm not going to permanently delete this because I don't want to upset anyone, but that gives you an idea of some of the cool new features in Media Central Cloud US 25.10. We've got the transcription, we've got the inspector, and we've got the ability to media manage directly in Media Central as well. Thank you.